Erica, good afternoon. They certainly have. And the good news here is no injuries have been reported, but there is a lot of property damage. And I want to draw your attention up to the roof. In fact, you can see that they are still pouring water on this thing, dousing some hot spots coming in from the roof there. The fire started here on Maverick Street, then it spread to two adjacent buildings. So there's a large scene and a lot of cleanup to do now that the fire is out for the most part. The call came in at 3.30 this morning, and at one point, flames were shooting out of the roof of 183 Maverick. At the peak, about 100 firefighters were battling this blaze in frigid outside temperatures. Boston Fire got support from neighboring cities due to the size and scope of this fire. And Boston Fire Department Commissioner Jack Dempsey says the fire was raging when the first crew arrived on scene this morning. The two had to make a quick uh, rescue of one person over the uh, aerial ladder. We did a uh, very quick primary search, but the fire forced us out into defensive operations very quickly. So as the commissioner said, one person rescued, but again, no injuries. Still, about 25 people are now displaced, and firefighters are staying here on the scene to douse any hot spots like the one you see uh, behind me with them putting water on it. The investigation is now underway into the cause and the origin of this fire. Reporting live in East Boston, Todd Kiskevich, WCVB News Center.